Glenfarris.com here. It's me, Peter, and Leonita. Um, we are at the Glenfarris Festival. Um, we just finished our Sunday morning mass, and and it's really crowded around here. Yes. So uh, this is the annual Glenfarris Festival located on Glenfarris Road in Hawthorne, Victoria, Melbourne. <laughs> yes. So this is the annual festival. It's happening like. The end of the Glen Ferry Road. It's not the end of the Glen Ferry. Not the end. The other, the but, other end, right? Yes, but yeah, it's it's along Glen Ferry Road, especially closer to the uh, Glen Ferry Station. Stations, uh, just near the Swinburne University in Melbourne. So as you can see, a lot of people here, and then I think they are looking for food. They are looking for fun activities for kids as well. Yes. And yeah, we are really excited because we always come here every year. I think this is my, I don't know, six, seven yeah. year to attend this festival because yeah, I, I love, I just, I just love being on Glen Ferry Road like, because they have everything in here. You don't need to really go to the city to get everything. It's Everything is on Glen Ferry Road, so I love it and we live nearby, so yeah. So I think it's getting crowded this year, what do you reckon? I think it's getting more crowded and crowded yeah. every year. But we haven't checked out that, that, that site where the action is, is happening. So um, let's follow our journey. We're gonna go check out that site. We'll probably get, grab some food for lunch as well and see what we can find. Usually they don't really hand out any deals uh, during like normal days, but today is the festival, so everyone's like trying to give you something at least. Let's continue. Okay, let's How do we do this? Yeah, we this. So, and you see to get one on here, adults, it's just the back line there. This competitions, um, like what is it, ring toast? They call it ring toast, which is not exactly a ring, but but a froyo cup. Yeah, froyo cup. <laughs> which is makes it a bit harder than a ring. So yeah, as you can see, lots of fun activities. I've never tried pretzel with American mustard before. I might try this actually. Do you want to buy one? Let's check out until the end of the road and we'll come back. Well, it's not live. So I think it's perfect. Couple of Hawthorne football stars. So they're doing the signing here. So. If you are a fan, the, the football club is based in Hong Kong. I don't really know anyone, but I know Tom Mitchell. <laughs> Sicily as well. What did you find? Chicken goose. I love goose juice. Yeah. So uh, at Glenfarris Road, Festival, uh, they always like have special five dollar stand. They have five dollar crushes. I think we have to step aside a little bit because it's like really packed here. Everyone's like trying to to get through. So, what do we find? The first one. I got five dollar boost. This is the mango tango crush. It's not a 
smoothie is a crush, so it's very refreshing. There's no milk in it. Perfect for sunny weather like today. This is a perfect drink. I'm not actually a fan of drinking the sweet stuff before getting some savory, so I'm gonna pass this drink. <laughs> this is mine then. <laughs> so we're gonna go that way again. Just find something. So guys, we are like the end of the the festival, the end of the road of the festival. Yes, um, the time is 12.50, we are hungry. I think we're just gonna go back down there and, yes, and find some more foods. Do you know what you wanna get? I think I'm going to get the Philly cheesesteaks. Okay. Because uh, I never really saw any shop selling that Philly cheesesteak on Glen Perry Road, so it's a new thing. Here, so right. uh, in this area, I mean. <laughs> I'm not quite sure what I'm going to get. The burger is good last year. Good deal. Wow. $5 it's still $5. It's, it's pretty good. <laughs> so half price, I think. Usually it's like around $10, $12. Um, I saw a roll with smoked meat before. So maybe I'm going to get that. It's, it's really good. Maybe you should try. And because no deep fried food for us. In the next few weeks, yeah, so. so we try to find something they are not deep fried. Not deep fried. Let, let's go down there and let's check out the food now. So guys, uh, this is the lunch for today. So this is the beef brisket uh, roll from Amastes. That's how. That's how you spell it, man. So you have like a beef brisket, see this fatty, fatty beef, they smoke it for, I don't know, a couple of hours maybe. See, and this one is without a sauce. The roll is pretty hot, so they have some coleslaw as well. So I'm so excited for this. That smoked meat is really good. It's it's really smoky. It's really beefy as well. I like this part of the the beef, the brisket, because it's like has a lot of fat in it. It has a lot of flavor. Um, the roll is not too hard as well, so that's pretty good. The meat is so tender, it's juicy. For eleven dollars, it's a good deal, I think. You wanna try? So this is beef, so I can eat it because I don't eat lamb or pork. It's like... So each is like two dollars and fifty cents. Um, not 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 entirely cheap, but 
it's it's so tempting, you know. They 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 do the the skewers like in front of the shop, like so tempting. You say the smoke is like everywhere. The smell is good. So yes, let's try. Chicken is tender. It's a little bit salty and sweet from the soy sauce. Overall, it's a good one. Although it's not very exciting to me, to be honest. I'm good, thank you. I'm really enjoying the day today. Well, we're very excited to have you here, of course. I agree, the chicken is tender. Uh, it's so moist. It's not dry at all. We can actually taste the smokiness from the charcoal. The meat is chunky as well, so it takes a little bit of effort to, to chew it, to bite it, but why? It? It's, not, it's not cheap at all, $2.50 for a skewer. But hey, it's festival. A little bit expensive to be honest, 12.50. But the cheese looks good. It looks very appetizing to me. Wow. Mm. Mm. The cheese is like melting in your mouth. I haven't got the beef. So we're here for the special event Hi. radio at uh, the Blue Prairie Festival for 2018. And uh, as uh, we're right we're the, the, the original Billy Tasty, so it's using what you call? beef slices here. I'm not sure what part of the beef actually. It's thin slices. Hey, uh, tell us about, before you go into this, I'm always interested to know the history of it. It's pretty good, the cheese is melting. <laughs> so maybe let's try with the sauce, do you think? Uh, you have to be worried about the shape just quietly for myself with the, with the big pies of mine. But yeah. you guys, uh, I've just seen the girls warming up back here. I've seen the most disaster. You know, and mango? Uh, I don't know. Uh, I might add some mustard. The poor girls look spectacular, so I'm going to take a break while the blue berry festival this year. So if you want to see some can can dancing, here we are. Okay, I put a lot of sauce, but I think it will taste even more good, uh, even better with the sauce. Because I need chili. Can't live without chili. <laughs> softer side compared to the roll that you that Peter had before with the smoked beef roll this one is a bit softer as you can see this inside is softer but the outside is slightly hard but not too hard yeah I enjoy this not for your everyday meal of course because I know it's this one has got a lot of calories. I think I'm a bit regret, but it's Sunday, you know, it's Sunday. <laughs> I'm just gonna have a cheat day today. We have this coffee and walnut scroll from, what's the name of the shop? Marcy? Yeah, so they have two types of uh, scroll, no, scroll flavors. One is the vanilla and the other one is the walnut coffee. So I thought I prefer this walnut and coffee the way they look. Let's try. It's not very sweet, which is good. Normally scroll, they put like lots of um, icing sugar on top, but this one not too sweet. Maybe I try the icing as well, the coffee icing. 
I think obviously it's sweet because it's made of sugar so but in terms of the scroll, scroll itself it's not very sweet which is good because I can enjoy it there is some walnut inside as well it's still crunchy texture of the scroll is mm, soft and good I think it's a good scroll for the price it's okay like three point $8.80 Maybe I prefer the original scroll like the cinnamon scroll but this one is just like a, like a gourmet scroll but it's a good scroll it's a good scroll still so yeah I enjoy this there you have it that's the festival the Grand Ferry Festival uh, we have a lot of fun a lot of food um, very sample and try what do you think? Maybe we'll see you guys again next year at the next uh, Grand Ferry Festival 2019. The festival is it's it's up and running until uh, five o'clock in the afternoon. So there's still like a lot of entertainment, a lot of a lot of things to check out. But um, yeah, we ha we have a lot of fun. We probably just gonna go home and have some rest, enjoy the the weekend. So if you like this video, guys, please do a thumbs up. Um, don't forget to leave a comment below. And don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe, that's the more important our thing. Food and travel journey. Yeah, yeah, so hopefully in the future we can do uh, things like that. Things like this again, um, if, if, if we visit festivals around Melbourne. So yeah, don't forget to thumbs up and see you in the another video.